Hi, I'm Matt. And I'm Dave. And in this Magento Basics tutorial, you're going to learn how to set up log cleaning in Magento. And with that said, we're going to jump straight across to Magento and we'll meet you there in a few moments time. So Dave, we've been to come across to our administration panel. Now, before I go off and change the settings, we'll show you where the settings are. It's worth pointing out that the default settings for Magento is to store the logs for 180 days. Now, that's a lot of months. That's a bit of a long time, that, isn't it? Yeah, and it's not uncommon for these log files to turn into gigabytes worth of data. So let's go and see the settings which we've got available. And it's also worth pointing out that you'll also need the Magento Cron running as well. Now, if you don't have the Magento Cron running or you've never heard of the Magento Cron, then check out one of our other video tutorials, either on YouTube or over at understandingne.com. And we'll talk you through and show you what the Cron does and how it works and how to automate it within your hosting account as well. Now, with that said, let's go to the topic of logs cleaning. Okay, so we want to go to system, down to configuration at the bottom. Now, Dave, this setting is right down at the bottom, down in advance. So we need to scroll all the way down to the bottom. Okay, and it could be a very long page, which you've got here. And then click into system. And then expand out the option called log cleaning. Dave, can you see I've already been in here and changed it to three yeah. days, right? But by default, Magento does come with this set at 180 days, which is a very, very long time. Now, for a production site, we would strongly recommend that that's a much lower value, up to a maximum of 30 days. Now, you'll want to choose the number of days on here where it says enable log cleaning. Change that from no to yes, like we've got set on here. And Dave, can you see with the start time for our site, I've been to set that at five past midnight? Yep. And the reason for that is that most people kind of get things set for midnight and just leave the default values. But if you set it for a couple of minutes past, so maybe 10 past, and then choose a different hour of the day. And if you think about, especially if you're on shared Magento web hosting, there's a lot of people who are setting things in there for midnight. And you can imagine if there's 15, 20, 30 people all running on the same shared web hosting, is that there's going to be a lot of tasks kicking off at midnight. It's a very busy time of the day. So instead of getting caught up in their backlog and it's taking forever, then just change the start time. Move it on an hour. Go to 1 o'clock in the morning. Go to 10 past 1 in the morning. Okay, so it's outside the normal cron running time and then it will run much quicker. So that's a little tip for you, especially if you're using shared web hosting. And then, of course, you can set the frequency to daily. Okay, and once you've been and made any changes in here, press save config in the top right hand corner. Oh, before we go, it's also worth pointing out if there was an error in there, you can pop in your email address and Magento will tell you about that error and again just to stress the point here you do need the magento cron set up in the background so that it's been automatically called so it will run at 10 past one in the morning or at the next available slot and like you said back at the beginning of this tutorial we do have a separate video tutorial on that over at understandthene.com or on youtube to show you how to do that so with that said that's how to set up log cleaning in magento and for myself matt and from me, Dave. Cheerios. So from myself, Matt. And me, Dave. We hope that you found this video tutorial helpful. If you have, then let us know by leaving a thumbs up on this video below or subscribing to our YouTube channel. We believe to use Magento, you don't need a degree in nerd. And we've created you over 300 step-by-step -step video tutorials at understandinge.com to help you. In these tutorials, you'll learn how to use Magento with no prior knowledge. How to build a fully responsive Magento website for just $99, which is about 65 quid. How you can use Magento to sell on eBay and Amazon with M2E Pro. And you'll be joined by over 6,000 fellow business owners just like you. And the best part is, it's free to join. So for myself, Matt. And me, Dave. We'll see you there. Cheerios.